think you have to start with the uh, the Fab Five, and that was my first introduction to the University of Michigan, uh, watching the Fab Five play, and then also in California, Michigan played at 12 o'clock. So when I was a kid, you cut the TV on, nine o'clock, and you watch Michigan. So that was pretty much my introduction as a youth, and then I just started following the program. And when recruiting started, I just had a love for Michigan. Even though I had options to go anywhere in the country, I explored them, but Michigan was always just a cut above. Uh, I think what really helped with me coming out to summer camp mm -hmm. and getting a chance to uh, touch the soil and meet the players and meet Coach Carr, <clears throat> I think that was probably the, the biggest influence was, was coming to the camp and interacting with the coaches. Now, when you came out, did, did Charles Drake come out too? So, funny story, my first scholarship offer in high school was from Ohio State, Coach Tim Spencer. So, uh, Drake and I at the time, we were we didn't really have a, a plan on going to school together, mm -hmm. but we were getting recruited by a lot of the same schools. So, uh, Ohio State was my first offer. As you don't know, if you might know, my mom and dad are both from Canton, Ohio. Mm -hmm. So I'm very familiar with Ohio. So I was like, Coach Spencer, you got to offer my, my running back. He was like, no. We already have a kid committed named Kelton Lindsey. Remember Kelton Lindsey? Mm -hmm. Same type of bat. Slasher, you know, 6'1", 185. I need a big bat. So they didn't offer Charles. So... Um, that summer, I went to Michigan camp. Charles went to Ohio State camp because he was competitive. He said, <laughs> <laughs> he said they're going to offer me if I go to camp because he knew he was going to run a 4-4, and, you know, he didn't get the offer. So um, I go to Michigan camp. At that time, they didn't know about Charles. So um, I go to Michigan. I get an offer from Michigan and then go to our senior year. Coach Carr tells you, we need to see the first three games of your season. So I said in the first three games, they wanted to make sure you were still progressing. Mm -hmm. I get a call back from Coach Hope. Hey, who's that running back? <laughs> who's, who's your running back? I said, his name was Charles Dre. Well, tell him we have a scholarship for him. <laughs> That's Brady. That's Brady playing. So I called Charles. I think I called him on three-way with Coach Hogan and he hung up the phone. I was like, hey, Drake, uh, Michigan wants to offer you a scholarship. Court stopped playing and hung up the phone. <laughs> so I called him back. And then Michigan started recruiting Charles. And they had, just because at that time there were no huddle links. Right. There was none of that. You know, I sent my tape to Michigan. He didn't. Right. And, of course, the tape was highlighting me. Right. Even though he had some explosive runs, but it took my senior year. But Coach Hope, they called it all over him. So mm -hmm. um, as we went through the process, neither one of us were really um, feeling USC at the time. Uh, I think Paul Hackett was the coach. And we took our visit, and we just didn't get a good vibe like we did at Michigan. And, I mean, it's Michigan, so.